yeah, just throwing that out there. I am so excited. Look. No sleeps. No sleeps. How excited are you? He's a little bit tired. He's got his little travel pillow ready. We're all packed and ready to go. I'm impressed. I've just got the three suitcases. Yeah. They're a little bit heavy, but it'll be fine. I'm sure it will. Yeah, we're just waiting for the taxi to come and pick us up. We're so excited this morning, we just can't wait. Yeah. We're in the taxi, we're on the way. Hey, good morning. Good morning. And we've got crazy granddad. There. So we've just arrived at Manchester Airport. Welcome. It's really strange, but I absolutely love the smell of aviation fuel and it smells lovely right now. Traveling through Manchester Airport in Terminal 2, you have to go through security, which is up the stairs. This is where I'll leave you for a minute because I can't keep filming. So we've made it through security, it was really, 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 really busy and long, but you know what? Didn't stress. I was on a holiday. Why am I stressed? Because we're very excited. And I'm very, 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 very busy. Very busy. Thank you, Harry. Yeah, don't get stressed about it and then it, it's just fine. Just keep walking, get what you need to do and get it done. So welcome to Manchester Airport Terminal 2 Departures. So we've got a Travelex, a WH Smiths as a first walk in. We've also got a boot. We eat chocolate. What was that? Sweets and chocolate. Sweets and chocolate. We've also got a Broderick's. Claire's accessories. And obviously, duty free. Crazy Grandad had already checked in and had his feet up in the lounge at this point. Um, he was travelling in upper class. He was traveling direct to Orlando. And those of you that have watched our other vlogs know that we were traveling uh, via Atlanta. We're now through to the other side of Duty Free. And we can see the place. I think it's now time to go and grab a coffee and some breakfast. First, what have we got for breakfast? Chocolate muffin. Chocolate muffin. Start the diet as we mean to go on. And I've got a lovely ooey gooey lemon. Mm. What have you got? Is it really tasty? Say bye to Grandad. Bye. 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 Safe travels. We'll see you in Orlando. Bye. See you in Orlando. Yeah. Done some shopping, heading towards the gate. We're getting so excited now. I can't wait to get on board. Yeah, really excited. A little bit of drama just occurred. Obviously, Crazy Grandad's supposed to be going on the Orlando flight, which he should be leaving now at about 10 o'clock. It's been delayed. It's been delayed till half one. Oh no. Yeah. Um, so it looks like we might arrive in Orlando before him after all. Sort us in the hair, but let's see what flight arrives for him. Yep. This is me coming to get you in this. Jeff hands. There is our aircraft. It's Ladybird. This is one I've never been on before. I absolutely love the 747. She is just beautiful. The crew have just got on and they're currently loading and putting catering on. 
hopefully won't be long. Just enjoying the view of the airport. Crazy Grandad is currently in the lounge and just putting his feet up while he waits. We're just sat waiting to board the aircraft. We had a technical fault with the airbridge. Go figure. So there's a slight delay on our aircraft now too. <sighs> Can't predict it, but hey, we're still going. We're still going. We're going today. That's all that matters. Yeah. Harry. He's so excited. Yeah. Exciting! Yeah. 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 Come on in. My say right. What a beignet. What a beignet. What a beignet. We just got onto the aircraft. We just got onto the aircraft. We're currently starting premium in the bubble. It's amazing. It's amazing. Uh, yeah, loads and loads and loads of like It's fantastic. We're gonna have a demonstration by Al. Just going to have a demo by Emily. We've got trays in there, massive big telly, and look at all that leg room. Loads and loads of leg room. Just got our pre arrival drinks. <laughs> Cheers, guys. Happy holidays. Cajun pasta salad, stir fried pork, chicken and mushroom casserole, asparagus and ricotta gnocchi, and passion fruit, sliced and cheese and crackers. We have already pre ordered. I'm having steak, stir fry, and David and Emily are having the chicken, and Harry has got a kid's meal. And then, oh, sorry, this is for tea.
and I've got the pork and noodles. Now we're on the subway. 
We're just heading to Concourse A. Hopefully without injury. On arrival into Atlanta, we landed into the International Terminal, which was Concourse F. We then had to make our way across to Concourse A. Before this, we had to clear immigration and security. Both are really busy, but really um, stress-free. There's loads of staff to help you out and show you what to do. Everything was clearly signposted and told us exactly where to go. We then had to make our way over on the craziest subway journey that we've ever had. It was literally felt like life or death. Once in Concourse A, we then just made our way to the gate and just waited around a little bit. Fortunately for us, there was, a, there was a slight delay on our flight, so it just meant us not having that last minute home alone dash to the gate. Oh my God, that's hot. You're obsessed with air conditioning, mate. It would feel like if we run one out, break it in hours. Just heading out to flight number two and going down this air bridge, it's like being in an oven. How hot is it in here? Just in hot. 40 degrees. Yeah. More like a million degrees. Wowzers! Delta's in-flight entertainment system was excellent. It was really responsive, had a great choice of films and TV programs, and it was all complimentary. Uh, there was even complimentary Wi-Fi on board, which you could send messages, um, and there was an opportunity to upgrade. You also got a complimentary snack and drink on board, and other food and beverages could be purchased. I think the enthusiasm is waning from my voice because I am so tired. This is a little bit strange coming through domestic. It's a brand new experience for us. People. Yep. So we're just heading to the terminal and baggage claim. <gasps> we get to go on the monorail. Fake monorail, but the monorail. You can see our buddy Diane's doing. Oh, the monorail! I hate this monorail! <laughs> <laughs> 
departing momentarily for the main terminal. You will be arriving on the third level of the main terminal. I'm trying to get in it! Baggage they just talk is on level two. But what she... Yeah, Hello, this is Orlando Mayor Buddy Dyer. If you're a resident of Central Florida, I want to welcome you home. If you're one of our 75 okay. million visitors, welcome to the City Beautiful. You probably know Orlando for its world-class oh, theme parks and attractions, but you may not know the other half of it. From our professional sports, high-tech and emerging medical industries, to our vibrant... This is a totally new experience for us, entering Orlando and Social Airport from domestic. It's, oh, it feels so strange. Here we are. Welcome home. But no Disney shop. Disney shop's gone. There it is. I can't reach it. I can't. What bag is next through the door? Nothing, because it's shut. Thank you for your cooperation. Level one. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? This is Magical Express. Only ticketed passengers with... So you need to head past all the car hire and just keep going. These weary feet are heading to Magical Express. You wouldn't think he's been awake for hours, would you? Yeah, I'm here. I think someone is a little bit excited. Look out the window! Magical Express buses! And here we are! It's like some comedy sketch. like it yeah just want to do a quick room tour we've not long since arrived so all the cases are still there but there's loads of places to put your cases in the corners you've got a lovely new table we've got one of the refurbished rooms which is great without carpet nice flooring excuse the weary sleeping travelers we've got emily and a little harry tucks up in bed he's fast asleep so two great massive beds, comes with a silent man too, <laughs> that's not standard. You get a lovely new bed, I can't speak now, telly, Disney telly, look the Disney TV, got the, obviously the Murphy day bed. How amazing is that picture? Is that bed? Was it for a teenager? 
Nah, not really. Probably a ten or under. Oh, God. Really cute. <gasps> wow, look at that bathroom. It's so cute. Look his way. Very tired and weary travellers. It's massive, big mirror. Lovely sink area. It's tell it's all lovely wood. We've even got some washboard music going on. <laughs> I love that flooring. It's really nice. The tiles are really beautiful. <gasps> oh, Princess and the Frog shower curtain, and then just your standard little bath. Um, and yeah, Mickey soaps. Can't take them home unless we buy them. Saving the environment, which we like. It's really pretty. We love it. And plenty of towels. What are your verdicts? Do you like the room? Yeah. Yeah. So that's it. End of day one, travel day. Um, it's been a really long day. We're all exhausted, in bed now. Hoping to make it to Extra Magic Hours in the morning at Hollywood Studios. We'll just have to see how we go. Partially unpacked, room's a bit of a mess now, but at least everything's out of the suitcases and we'll have something to wear in the morning. Um, so don't forget to click that like and subscribe button. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.